s plus y is equal to 5, s y is equal to 6. What is the value of s and y? Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, I want to find the value of s and y. From this given equation, s plus y is equal to 5 and s y is equal to 6. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Solution. S plus Y is equal to 5. This is equation 1. S Y is equal to 6. This is equation 2. All right. Now from equation 1, let's make X the subject of formula we have. S is equal to 5 minus Y. Let's call this equation 3. Now, let's substitute for equation 3 in this equation 2. Now, that is anyway, you see what S, you put 5 minus Y there. Now, we have 5 minus Y into Y is equal to 6. Now, let's open this bracket. We have 5 Y minus Y square is equal to 6. Now we have 5y minus y square minus 6 is equal to 0. Let's write this equation. Then y square minus 5y plus 6 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation which can be solved by using either quadratic general formula or factorization method. Now, in this case, we are going to make use of factorization method. That is, we have y squared minus 3y minus 2y plus 6 is equal to 0. Then, let's factor y out. y into y minus 3 minus 2 into y minus 3 is equal to 0. Now we have y minus 3 here and y minus 3 here. This is y and this is minus 2. Now, y minus 2 multiplied by y minus 3 is equal to 0. Now, y minus 2 is equal to 0. Therefore, y is equal to 2. Or, from here, y minus 3 is equal to 0. Therefore, y is equal to 3. Let's call this y1 and this y2. Now, we want to find the value of s. We've gotten the value of y, but we don't know the value of s. Let's substitute for y in either equation 1 or equation 2. Now, in this case, I'm going to make use of equation 2. Our equation 2 is giving us sy is equal to 6 at y equal to 2 that is y1 we have s into 2 is equal to 6 now we have 2 s is equal to 6 let's divide both sides by 2 2 s divided by 2 is equal to 6 divided by 2 this one will cancel the x, 2 here, 1, 2 here, 3. Now, x1 is equal to what? 3. That is the value of x. Now, at y is equal to 3, let's see what will happen. We have xy is equal to 6. Now, s into 3 is equal to 6. Now, we have 3s is equal to 6. Let's divide both sides by 3. We have 3s over 3 is equal to 6. This one cancel this. This is over 3. Now, 3 here 1, 3 here 2. Therefore, s is equal to 2. Let's call this s2. Therefore, our hands final answers are s is equal to 3 y is equal to 2 
or s is equal to 2 y is equal to 3 that is our final answer if you enjoy the class like share and subscribe thank you